Hello everyone, my name is Mary, I'm Ukrainian, and I'm here to tell you about Russia and Ukraine. Historically, Ukraine was founded about 1,500 years ago. It was called Kiev and Rus. Only six centuries later, Kiev Prince Yulri Dolgoruki founded Moscow. For many reasons, we have a different mentality that has been formed throughout our history. Ukrainians are strong-willed and resolute, while the Russians are slaves and cowards. An interesting fact is that Ukrainians understand all Slavic languages to a greater or lesser degree. At the same time, Russians understand only their language, despite the fact that they consider themselves Slavs. In 1991, after the dissolution of the Soviet Union, Ukraine became independent. Our mentality, culture and traditions are closer to European. We want to have a cutting-edge country, but Putin, as the leader of Russia, has the goal of restoring the USSR. Unfortunately, he wants to do it with aggressive methods and make us slaves of his ideas. In 2014, Putin occupied part of our territory, the Crimean Peninsula. At the same time, Russia troops invaded eastern Ukraine. As a result, many people died there, losing their homes and families. My uncle was in this war. His physique is damaged, and it was hard to recover. Some men can't live an ordinary life due to post-traumatic syndrome and others died fighting for our country. This war continues for eight years. The skillful non-stop propaganda of Russian TV makes some people in the occupied regions believe that it is Ukraine that has invaded there. Just let think, Ukraine invaded part of Ukraine, which sounds crazy, of course, Given the facts about Ukrainians hate Putin, some people have relatives or even families in Russia, and this is what connects them to it. Some people have a natural attitude. We lost so many people just because of Russian aggression. Our natural desire is that children have a happy childhood and adults have a good future for Ukraine. This is what should be without any doubt. Despite our huge losses, Russia's aggression made us stronger and we united together. We are a peace-loving country and we have never attacked anyone. We are a victim of aggression. Our big goal is to join the European Union as well as to join NATO. It is these desires of ours that make Putin so angry. I'm Ukrainian and I'm proud of this. We live in a democratic country where everyone is free. At this time in Russia, people are pressed by the government. A few days ago, people were arrested in Russia during a protest against the war. Even children were arrested. Luckily, they are fine now. On the 24th of February, Putin started a special military operation, as he said, but in reality, it is a full-scale war against Ukraine. Только что по телеге Киев. После авиа удара. A lot of cities and villages are damaged. The villains get hurt. Innocent children are dying. In this terrible war against aggressive Russia, our army is fighting bravely. But we need its support. People who want to help our army can donate on this site. 
I will leave the link below. If we don't stop Putin now, aggression will expand further and more people will die. People, let's stop Putin aggression for a peaceful and good future. Slava Ukraini!